her, Paul Skeen, sorry, Libby Dunn's boyfriend. At some point, it would be Dunn's fiance or husband, unfortunately. Yeah, she'll um, leave him at some point. They all do. Oh, no, Libby Dunn is just perfect. Libby Dunn's the thing. Libby Dunn, um, the, the, Again, I guess he would actually be the man, the myth, the legend, Paul Skeens. Um, the the backup backup quarterback at LSU, just an absolute king side. But anyways, uh, Tops has come out with one of the coolest. Is it Tops? Yeah, it's a Tops uh, Chrome update. And I actually have two boxes of this at my house waiting you- for me to rip it open. Oh, um, can we do that live? Yeah, we can do it live. I'll, I'll do it live next uh, next time we're on. Would we be able to see the disappointment in your face when you don't get it? No, because somebody actually did the math. In order to get that card, they said that you'd have to average spending about $250,000 worth of Topps products in order to guarantee that you could get one of those one of ones. So the way it works is every baseball player, they put that little MLB debut patch on their jersey for their first game. Tops slash Fanatics takes that jersey, takes the patch off, and embeds it into a card that is a one of one. And then the said rookie signs the card. So there's only one of those MLB debut signed Paul Skeen's patch cards out there. And the Pirates are getting ahead of it and trying to bribe whoever finds that card with a nice little package of stuff. Yes, and that package, and I'm gonna, I've got it all pulled up here. That package includes a pair of season tickets. How about this? Okay, we're gonna start here. A pair of season tickets right behind home plate for the next 30 years. James, is yeah. that enough for you to give up that card? No, because I don't live anywhere near Pittsburgh. That's the question okay. that I had. <laughs> okay, does uh, you get to play? They upped it up a little bit more. You get to play in a softball game for you and 29 of your closest friends at PNC Park, along with other Pirates alumni um, and all those alumni get to act as coaches. James, season tickets and softball game in PNC Park, is that enough for you? Uh, no, but again, my answer is going to be no on everything because I'm not in Pittsburgh. That's not that- fun, James. You're supposed to play along with the game. No, but it, it's, it makes a big difference. If somebody finds it and they live in New York, what, what do they have to offer somebody else? Okay, that's not fun, James. Play along with the game. We can get there. Okay, fine. Uh, no, that's not enough. What else do you got, Dave? A private tour of Pirate Spring Training. Pirate City, by the way, in case you didn't know what that was called. Um, so Pirate Spring Training and a chance, a chance to take batting practice and warm up with the team. James, is that enough to give up the card? No, not quite enough. Okay, we're, they upped it up with one more thing. You get a meet and greet with Paul Skeens himself, two autographed jerseys, plus other, air quote, unique experiences yet to be determined. James, is that enough for you to give up the card? Ooh, that's getting close. I don't know, but it might not be enough for me. I say from a from a cash value standpoint, it's probably pretty close, right? The season tickets for long for right behind home plate for 30 years. That's, that's about 250 grand. Yeah, that's like cool. we're getting there. Like the money wise, they've they've definitely put it the money on the table. They've yeah, this is the type of stuff like the Otani baseball when it hits the stands. Like this should be the type of offer people should be getting. Like a, a meet and greet is personal. Like this is the type of offer we should be seeing from other stuff. 